Good evening, everybody. Good evening, teacher. Oh, good evening. Let me see. Hello, good evening. Good evening. In this moment, we are seven. Okay, good evening, everybody. We are going to start the class in this moment. So how are you? How was your day? What's terrible, good, stressful, fantastic? Let's see, this is from eight to nine. Okay, let's see. We are nine in this moment. I have Edith Lorena Herrera, Juan Antonio, Maria de Los Angeles. And I have Luz Marguel Garcia Reyes, Maria de Los Angeles Jimenez, Miguel Antonio Abrego, Roxana Guadalupe, Veronica Maricela Alegría. We have Lenin. We have uh, Miguel Antonio Abrego, Damaris Leticia, hello, hello. Consuelo del Rosario. Present, Hello, good evening. Good evening. Now we're going to start with places in town. Okay, my friends, we're going to start here with places in town. Okay, I'm going to share with you this uh, screen. This is about places in town. So here we're going to identify different places in town. We have school, museum, bank, airport, post office, zoo, restaurant, train station, supermarket, hospital, a bus stop, park, fire station, and police station. So, for example, number one, what is the picture number one? Museum. Museum. This is the number one. Yeah. What is the Museum. number two? Number two. Supermarket. Supermarket. Number three. Uh, what could be? Restaurant. 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 Okay. A restaurant. So this one? This um What's office. Mm, I, I guess know. that is a school. Ooh. A school, school, right? School. School. Yes, this one? Hospital. 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 This one? Zoo. The zoo. 
This one? Police police station. Police station. This one? Fire station. Fire station. This one? Bus stop. Bus stop. Bus stop. Very good. This one? Bus stop. Train station. Train station. Station. This one? Airport. 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 Very good. This one? Post, uh, post, post office. office. Post office. office. Okay, yes. This one? A bank. A bank. bank. A bank. And the last one? Park. Park. The park. park. Okay, very good. So, now we are going to start talking about places in town for this unit. And uh, the first activity, again, talking about places in town is this one. So I'm gonna show you the picture and you're gonna tell me the corresponding name, the name that belongs to this. So for example, the number one, you can, you can sleep at? Hotel. At a hotel, very good. Number two. You can see sea animals around. No, sir. No. Sea animals. Sea animals. No, sir. Aquarium. Aquarium. Very good. Mm -mm. Number three. You can go jogging on a. Parking, no. Running path. Running path. Running path. Teacher, ¿qué, qué, qué es jogging? jogging? Yoga. Ah. Similar to yoga. Yes. Okay. So, you can go skateboarding on a... Skateboard round. Skateboard round. Okay. Let's see. Yes. So the next one that is the number five. You can see a play at a stadium. 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 Or no. Yes. Stadium. Stadium. Or the stadium. Stadium. Okay. That's a theater. This play refers when you have like a like a, it's a movie. Tiene calor. Huh? You can see art and interesting museum. exhibits. Okay, museum. museum. Ask for Mos information at visitor, visitor center. center. Visitor center. Visitor center. You can leave your car at a parking garage. Parking garage. garage. Very good. This is the number nine. You can watch a baseball game at a study. Okay. And the final one that is the number 10, you can swim in an other pool at a Water, water park. park. Water park. Water there park. Yes, water park. So that means that we are going to continue practicing with places around town. So the activity is this one. Just give me a second. It's this one. Okay, look at here. Here we are going to listen the next activity. Okay, pay attention, okay? Okay. Hi, everyone. In this class, you'll learn vocabulary for stores and other places. And, and discuss where you can get different things. Let's get started by listening and practicing. 
One. You can buy aspirin at a drugstore. Two. You can buy bread at a supermarket. Three. You can buy a dictionary at a bookstore. Four. You can buy gasoline at a gas station. Gas station. Five. You can buy a sandwich at a restaurant. Six. You can buy stamps at a post office. Seven. You can buy a sweatshirt at a department store. Eight. You can buy traveler's checks at a bank. What I would like for you to do next is to practice the vocabulary that we just learned. For example, you can pay bills at a bank. You can buy shoes at a department store. After you complete this activity, share your work in our discussion forums. Hi, everyone. Okay. So, uh, for the places that are being described here, please write, uh, take notes here on the chat of this Zoom class or in your notebook, okay? Everyone, in this class, you'll learn vocabulary for stores and other places and discuss where you can get different things. Let's get started by listening and practicing. One, you can buy aspirin at a drugstore. Okay. Two. Right. You can buy aspirin. Say notes. Two. You can buy aspirin. You can buy aspirin at a drugstore. Okay. You can buy aspirin. Here you have to write it. You can buy aspirin at a drugstore. Say notes. You can buy aspirin at a drugstore. Say notes on your notebook. This is the number one. You can buy aspirin at a drugstore. Number two. Aspirin at a drugstore. Two. You can buy bread at a supermarket. Okay. You can buy bread at a supermarket. Okay. They know. Three. You can buy a dictionary at a bookstore. You can buy a dictionary at a bookstore. They know you can buy a dictionary at a bookstore. Four. You can buy gasoline at a gas station. You can buy gasoline at a gas station. They know. They know. You can buy gasoline at a gas station. Five. You can buy a sandwich at a restaurant. You can buy a sandwich at a restaurant. You can buy a sandwich at a restaurant. Next one. Six. You can buy stamps at a post office. You can buy stamps at a post office. You can buy stamps at a post office. Post office. Take notes. Write information. Seven. You can buy a sweatshirt at a department store. You can buy a sweatshirt, sweatshirt at a department store. You can buy a sweatshirt at a department store. I guess that's the last one. Eight. You can buy traveler's checks at a bank. You can buy traveler's check at a bank. You can buy traveler's check at a bank. And this one, wait, 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 wait. I'm going to close this. This in here. Okay, did you take notes about the places where you can buy different things? Okay, let's see this one. Buying here is Oops.
Okay, now let's see the next exercise here. Can you please write two sentences? Two sentences similar to the ones that we heard in a moment, okay? You can buy aspirin in a drugstore. You can buy a sweatshirt at a department store. Okay, right here, two sentences in the chat. Go ahead. Write two sentences. Ready? No yet? Can can I buy uh shoes in the store? Okay, so but you have to write it here in the chat. You can buy oh. shoes. Okay, you can buy shoes. Write it here in the chat. Okay, meanwhile I'm going to take notes about your attendance. Let me see what is it. Okay, you're telling me present. It says Araceli Esmeralda Lopez Garcia. No? Present teacher. Very good. So, Carlos Arturo Olmedo Magaña. Present. Thank you. And Consuelo de Rosario Alemán López. Alemán Gómez, sorry. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Cristian Daniel Alvarado Briseño. Cristian, no. Damaris Leticia García Torres. Present. Okay. Edith Lorena Herrera Vázquez. Present. Thank you, thank you. Next one, Fátima Yesenia Araujo Medina. Then okay, thank you. Fernando de Jesús Morales Enriquez. Present. Okay. Ibis Arely Torres Guzmán. Present. Okay, thank you. Joaquín Jesús Galán Valladares. Present teacher. Okay, thank you, Joaquín. Present teacher. Okay, thank you. Present. Next one. Jorge Eric Ramirez Ramos. Present teacher. Okay. Juan Antonio Villatoro Torres. Juan Antonio, no. Carla Susana Galeas Argueta. Present teacher. Juan Antonio. Yes. Okay. Okay, very good. So, Carla Susana Galea Sargueta? No yet. And Catherine Rebecca Rosales de Quintanilla? Catherine Rebecca? Lenin Monterrosa Delgado? Luz Margel Garcia Reyes? Present. Okay, nice. Teacher, no sé si me escuchó. Hola. What's your name? Este, Katherine. Katherine, Katherine, Katherine. Rebeca. Okay. Sí. Yes, here. Okay, that's okay. Okay. María de los Ángeles Jiménez Morales. And... Uh, let me see, Mauricio Alberto Jiménez Majano. Miguel Antonio Obrego Hernández. Present. Ah, okay. Naomi Nicole Deras Asensio. Present. Okay. And Oscar Esaú Mesa Leiva. I'm present, teacher. Okay. Roxana Guadalupe Duarte Garcia. Present. 
Sandra Margarita Martínez Castellanos. Present. Okay. En Verónica Maricela Alegría Mejía. Present. Yancy Alexandra Rodríguez Alvarado. Present. Okay, very good. Okay, so we continue with the next activity. Is this one to finish this? And we're gonna have a, a listening exercise. No, it's not the listening, it's this one. It's this one. Okay, let me see the ones that you have written. You can buy bread at the supermarket. You can buy gasoline at the gas station. Sandra Margarita, very good. Now I have a Miguel Antonio. You can buy a book at the library. Luz Margel, you can buy a dress in a department store. A bit. you can buy pills at a drugstore. Yes. Very good. Roxana Guadalupe, you can buy cookies in a bakery. Okay. You can buy the dinner in a restaurant. You can buy dinner at a restaurant. You can buy cloth at a department store. You can buy uh you can buy fruits in the supermarket. You can buy food in a restaurant. You can swim in a pool. You can buy in a restaurant. You can buy food in a restaurant, you can buy clothes at a mall, you can buy coffee in a supermarket, you can buy shoes in the store, in the Payless store, okay, you can buy flowers in the garden, okay, okay, very good, so now let's see, the next activity is this one, the one that you have in the book, we are going to List the um, audio related to locations. Which illustrates how, illustrates how this topic is used in a real life setting. Let's get started by listening to a conversation titled It's Across from Let's Listen and Practice. Excuse me, can you help me? Is there a public restroom around here? A public restroom? Hmm. I'm sorry, I don't think so. Oh no, my son needs a restroom. Well, there's a restroom in the department store on Main Street. Where on Main Street? It's on the corner of Main and First Avenue. On the corner of Main and First? Yes, it's across from the park. You can't miss it. Thanks a lot. Now, I would like to talk about... There's a restroom in the department. Sorry, I don't think so. Oh, no. Oops, sorry. Now we're going to practice this conversation that is here in your book. Just let me close this. The manual, this one. The conversation. This is the... No, this is this is your manual. This one. Okay, this one. Okay, so these were the places that we were studying previously. And this is the conversation that we are going to practice together. Okay, so I'm gonna read and you repeat after me. Excuse, excuse me, can you help me? Is there a public restroom around here? Excuse, excuse me. me, can you help, can you help me? me? Is, is there, there a public restroom around, around here? here? Mm -hmm. Okay, a public restroom? Mm, I'm sorry, I don't think so. A public restroom? I'm sorry. I don't think so. I don't think so. Sorry. I don't think so. Okay, very good. I don't think so. Oh no, my son needs a restroom. 
Okay. Well, there is a restaurant in the department store on Main Street. Okay. Um on Main Street. Where on Main Street? Where, Where on, Main on Main Street? Where on Main Street? It's on the corner of May and First Avenue. It's on the corner of May and First Avenue. On the corner of May and First Avenue. On the corner of May and First. On the corner of May and First. And First. And first. Yes, it's across from the park. Yes, it's across, yes, it's across, from, across the from the park. You can't miss it. You, you can't can miss, miss, can miss, miss it. Okay. Thanks a lot. Thanks, Thanks a, lot. a lot. Okay, very good. Now I need two volunteers to practice this conversation. Mm. Okay, got it. Okay, very good. So one is going to be the man and the other the woman. Okay. So one, two, three. Go ahead. Edith, okay. Sí, Vis. Ah, pues yo soy el hombre. Okay. Excuse okay. me. Can you help me? Is there a public restroom around here? A public restroom? Mm, I am sorry. I don't think so. Oh, no. My son needs a restroom. Well, there's a restroom in the department store on Main Street. Where on Main Street? It's on the corner of Main and First Ave Avenue. Yeah. Oh, the corner of Main and mm. First? Yes, it is across from the park. You can you can miss it. Thank you. Okay, very good. Now two more volunteers to practice the conversation. Yo, Oscar. Okay, Oscar. And thank you, Oscar. Luz. 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 Okay, very good. Go ahead. Okay, okay. You inicio. Excuse me, can you help me? Is there a public restaurant around here? A public restroom? Hmm, I'm sorry. I don't think so. Oh no, my son is a restroom. Well, there's a restroom in the department store on Main Street. Where on Main Street? It's on the corner of May and First Avenue. On the corner of May and First? Yes, it's across from the park. You can miss it. Thank you a lot. Okay, very good. Thanks a lot. Very good. Okay, Thanks. now who needs the restroom? Questions about the conversation. Who needs the restroom? Is su hijo. His, uh -huh. son. His son. Very good. His son. Okay. And where is the nearest restroom? Is in the department store on the main street. Okay. Very good. Okay. And uh, mm, let me see what else. And uh, Okay, so let me see. Excuse me, can you is it a public restaurant? Aha, uh -huh. he was looking for a public restaurant, right? Okay, and he says it was on Main Street. Okay, very good. Now, the next exercise is this one. This one that we have here. This is the grammar focus preposition of place. So we have on, on the corner of, look at the picture. This is on, on Main Street. 
on the corner of this one. It's this one. On the corner of in the corner of. Uh -huh. So the next picture it says across from. Across from. Next picture says next to. And the final one says between. For example, the department store is on May Street. Let's see if, if it is this one. The department store is on May Street. Department store, this one. The department store is on May Street. Yes, it's correct. Number two, it's on the corner of May and first. The department is on the corner of May and first. It's on the corner of May and first. Very good. So it's across from the park. It's across from the park. The department store is across from the park. It's next to the bank. So the department store is next to the bank. Okay, look at the picture here. Look at the map. And the bank is between the department store and the restaurant. The bank is between the department store and the restaurant. Those are the locations, okay? Now we're going to complete the exercise. Looking here at the map, in the map we have a gas station, we have a post office, a Second Avenue bookstore, we have Davis store, supermarket, this one is, a supermarket, a restaurant, a restaurant, city bank, a department store, or the theater. Sorry. And the written movie theater. Now the streets. In the streets, we have First Avenue. This one is the First Avenue. This is the Second Avenue. The street's name is Central Street, Central Street, and this one, the one that is here, Main Street, is Main Street or Principal Street, Main Street or Principal Street. Now, based on this, based on this, you are going to look at the map and complete the sentence. For example, the coffee shop is on... Second Avenue, the coffee shop. What is the coffee shop? Ah, this one. The coffee shop says is on Second Avenue. Coffee shop is on Second Avenue. Yes, it's the shoe store. It's what is the shoe store? Ah, it's next to right. It's next to the shoe store. Number two, the movie theater. This is the movie theater. Is Park and Main. The movie theater is between, between the park. No, the park and Main. This one. This one is the Main. Okay, and the number three, the gas station is, where is the gas station? Can you see? The gas station is the parking lot. The gas station is the parking lot. What is the direction? Across. Across from very good. Okay. Yes, the post office. Okay, it's the hospital. It's it's across from the hospital. It's in front of the hospital. Can be no, or is maybe next to can be. And the last one, the bank is. Look at here. Where is the bank? The bank is the main street. Next to, next to number five, the, the bank is next to the restaurant and the department store. No, 
the bank is between the restaurant and the department store and the department store. It's on Main Street. It's on Main Street. Okay, so we're going to have a short practice using the proposition of places. Just give me a second. <clears throat> Una pregunta, teacher, eh, between en español es después, o qué significa? No. Between, what's the meaning of between? What's the meaning of between, my friends? Between. Entre. 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 Como... Entre. Yes. Medio de. Yes. Entre. Yes. Now look at here. Entre nosotros. Entre nosotros. Like here. We're going to practice this in this exercise. We're going to practice the preposition of place in this exercise. For example, it says, this one, number one, this is a this is a dog. What proposition are you gonna use? Inside, over, outside, next to, in front of, between, under, on, around, behind, or at. Okay, let's see. For example, here uh, in the number one, the dog is inside inside okay. inside Is and you are here inside okay. mm -hmm. now the plane is over over okay well, let's see if we have behind under around Be between behind. okay so in this exercise, you are going to complete it as an individual activity. Let me see, I'm gonna share the link here and you're gonna complete oops, the exercise in this moment. Okay, can you see the link? Yes. Okay, go ahead and complete the exercise, please. Remember, please open your camera. Meanwhile, you are completing the exercise. I can see if you are working. Open your cameras, please. Go ahead, complete the exercise. Oscar Mesa, please write your complete name. Oscar. Okay, open your cameras, please. Okay, when you finish, when you finish, post the result here in the chat of the Zoom class.
Okay, open your cameras to complete the exercise. Okay, when you finish, write the results here, here in the chat. Okay, so before we check with your in your group, once you finish, you are going to check in the group your answers. But before doing so, we are going to practice this listening exercise. In this listening exercise, you are going to check. Please, this is this one, this one. Places in town. This one? Oops. No. Okay. It's this one. Okay. Now in here. Okay. To complete this exercise, we are talking about locations. It says listen and you're going to type. You're going to write in your computer. Type. Okay. You click here. Where is the Down. school? Okay. So I'm gonna play here and you where write, is the school? You write the answer. So the next it's between the library and the park. Okay, and you write it's between oops, it's between the okay. Now here, you share your answers. And the correct uh, sentence was, it's between, between the library and the park. Okay, so you check here your answer. And for any additional support, you have here the Spanish, Spanish translation, okay? Okay, again, so you click here. It's between the library and the park. Okay, and write according to what you hear. Yes. And so if you want to skip and continue, and here you are, the answer is between the library and the park. So in that way, you are checking if the information that you wrote here, it is uh, the one that you have here. So you're gonna check. If you can get the listening and write information at the same time. This is very important. And it's a very nice exercise for you to um, understand more your listenings. Okay, I'm gonna share with you here in the link in the in the in the Zoom class the link of this activity that we're gonna practice together. Okay, so did you get the second link? Yes or no? Okay, and I'm going to organize the different groups to practice. Different groups to practice. You are 24 according to this. So, okay. Okay. 
So most of the groups are in group of four or three. Okay, getting to your getting to your room and remember you're gonna compare the previous exercise and you're gonna check the listening exercise. You're gonna work together. Remember, this is a collaborative exercise. You practice and discuss with your group. It's not individual, it's not llegalo por tu parte, yo lo lleno por el mío. Y no, la razón de ser del, del grupo es para dis que discutan las respuestas entre todos. Uno comparte y el de los demás discuten para poner la respuesta del ejercicio. Ok, voy a abrir acá. Please get into the group that you've been assigned. Go ahead. Okay, Consuelo, Verónica, ajá, Fernando, Oscar, Miguel, Mauricio, Joaquín, Ibis. Get into your rooms, please. Consuelo, you are in the room. The group seven, Consuelo. Go to the group number seven, Consuelo. And Veronica, are you here, Veronica? Sí, pero no lo puedo. Quiero ver. Vaya, aquí posiblemente está la. Solo voy a mover la paja. La de eso. Lo... Eh, es la... eh, comparlo, comparar las la, eh, respuestas del primero y después lo del segundo link, que era el listening. Yes, that's correct. What is the what is the school design? What is the school design? Tengo que pasar eso, escribir lo que escuchamos. Eso es lo que vi. Eso es lo que entendí, más o menos. Bueno, acá dice complete. Any questions so far? Questions about the exercise? Eh, teacher, sería completar lo que escuch según lo que escuchemos. Uh -huh. Puede uno de los dos compartir la pantalla para ir viendo lo que van haciendo. Sí. Yo estoy en teléfono, Ticha. Sí, no fíjese que el teléfono es muy breve. Puede, no puede compartir eh, en el chat, teacher, es que no, no, lo, no me aparece a mí. ¿Y hoy? Eh... O ya le debería de aparecer, Consuelo. ¿En el chat de, del eh, grupo que tenemos o en, eh, y en eh, Zoom? En el chat de Zoom dejé el link de la actividad. Sí, pero no está ya. Aparece. Aparece. Ah, ok. Se lo voy a compartir otra vez. Denme un segundito. 
Vaya, que se lo voy a poner otra vez. Va, listo. Voy a coger. Pues, es. Claro que sí. Vaya, trate de compartirlo con el compañero y ya regreso. Bueno. ¿Quién que sabe? Déjame ver lo, lo, uh, el concepto de ad. Excuse me. Uh, el del chico con los libros es atrás de, ¿verdad? Sí, se estaba viendo que... Hola, hola, sí, perdón la interrupción. Miguel, María de Los Ángeles, Araceli, ¿puede alguno de los tres compartir la pantalla? Para que uno vaya demostrando y lo tiene entre todos, completando. No le aparece la opción en la parte de abajo. No, no me aparece. Ah, ok. Ahorita. Bueno, si no le aparece, no se va a poder. Miguel, Antonio y Araceli, no le aparece a ustedes tampoco. No, como soy desde, desde el teléfono. Eh, puede ser, puede ser, pero... Ajá. A mí no me parece tampoco, teacher. Ok. Vamos a revisar porque no importa que sea de teléfono, debería de aparecer la opción de compartir. Bueno, yo regreso por acá. You continue practicing, please. Un buen oído tienen. Hola, eh, Jorge, Naomi, Ibis. ¿Quién de los tres puede compartir la pantalla? ¿Cómo? Ah, Ibis, Jorge o Naomi, que puedan compartir la pantalla para que vayan a hacer el ejercicio. ¿Quién puede compartir ah. la pantalla? ¿Puede usted, Jorge? Uh, no. Oh. No, no sé dónde. Ahí está. Compartiendo. Ella le puede dar clic ahí e ir, ir escribiendo para que todos ah, no sepan se lo que están Sí, sí. Ok, sí, go ahead. Right. Sí. ¿Quién de los tres lo está haciendo? De los cuatro. Okay, este, Naomi. Lo... Yo, vaya, Naomi. Uh, sí. Vaya. Entonces ya estamos en, en sintonía los cuatro. Sí, ya, lo único que... ya. Sí. Yo solo los escucho, no los veo. <risa> Pero igual, más que estamos ahí. Vale, sí, entonces ahí. vamos con el sexto. Sí, no sé si sería así, el número seis. El sexto de Como Xnets. Sí, así es. Next to the supermarket. Next to the supermarket. Uh -huh. Pasamos al siguiente. Bueno, lo lo sí. anotaron. 
Sí. Yo no le voy tomando captura por ahí. Ah, vaya. Va. Eh, uh. Where is the gas station? Estamos. Hola, hola. Lo que sí que no se escuchó. El 7. No, perdón. Dele el play. Naomi, Naomi. Dele play, por favor. No escuchamos. Ahí tiene que compartir. Antes de compartir hay que ponerle que hay que compartir con sonido. Para que escuchemos todos. Si gusta, deje de compartir, Naomi, y lo vuelve a hacer. Pero hay, hay que darle la opción de compartir con sonido. Ahí le va a aparecer. Ajá. Va a, a compartir. Sí, mis. Where is the gas station? Aha, very good now. Thank you. Very good. Vaya, hoy ya sabe, ¿verdad? Y este, eh, trate de practicar cada quien por su parte, no importa que sea este teléfono. Para que vayamos aprendiendo todos, ¿ok? Ok, gracias. Casi los llamo a la sala principal porque ya va siendo la hora. Ok, thank you. Where is the gas station? Yes, don't forget to write your complete name. Oscar Mesa, write your complete name, please. Oscar Mesa. And I have here in the attendance list. Oh, sí, ya me volví a reconectar. Thank you, yes. Now, Christian Daniel Alvarado. No. Carla Susana Galeas. Present teacher. Okay. Okay. Lenin Monterrosa Delgado. Present teacher. Okay, very good. So, um, María de los Ángeles Jiménez. No. And Mauricio Alberto Jiménez Majano. Mauricio, okay, let's see, and this one is Renee tonight. Okay, Oscar Mesa, write your complete name. Oscar, Oscar, Oscar. Okay, my sí, friends. Sí, sí. Eh, bueno, hoy de último les puse un ejercicio de listening. Ese lo pueden seguir este, practicando. Ese es como un dictado. Usted escucha, va escribiendo y ahí le sale ya que usted puede checar la respuesta para que usted confirme lo que ha escrito. Acuérdese que estamos en el proceso de aprendizaje y a veces en un principio, pues no vamos a comprender todo. Pero poco a poco sí deberíamos de ir comprendiendo eh, lo que nos van diciendo y nosotros ir escribiendo a corte. Ok, my friends. We're going to stop it here. Yes, Tommy. Ok, teacher. Yeah. Dicha. Uh -huh. No sí. sé este qué pasará este conmigo. ¿Por qué, mis? Me manda que se hace en el link que envía, ¿verdad? Va a los abro y a la hora de enviar, yo se guardan, sí, pero me, me saca de la página y ya no puedo este, copiar, o sea, verlo de nuevo. O sea, 
los links que son... habrá en el, en el chat del, del grupo de WhatsApp. Eso lo iba a decir yo, que era lo mejor. Sí, si no lo puede compartir en el chat para hacer el ejercicio. Ah, ok, claro, con gusto. Aquí se los voy a dejar. Ahí se los voy a alojar entonces, no hay problema. Ok, okay. para que you practice. Ok, thank you, my friends. I'm going to see you tomorrow, ok? Have a good night. I see you, teacher. Good, good night. night. Good night. Good night.